Good morning, everybody. Welcome to Southeast Raleigh Magnet High School, one of the best schools in the Wake County Public School District. I'm excited to share with you all the amazing teaching and learning that takes place inside of Southeast Raleigh Magnet High School every day. So we have four fantastic pathways, including arts, design, engineering, and humanities. We'll start off looking at the arts. Performing arts as a whole teaches confidence. The students learn that sometimes um, plans can change like just like that and learning how to adapt and adjust. In this unit they are learning about dialects and uh, podcasts. So right now our focus is dialects. So far we've done Cockney and like a British accent and then we've also done Irish, Australian and a little bit of French. One of the first things we learn in technical theater that everyone should learn in technical theater is safety. We also learn a bit about design and things of that nature, as well as the different tools that you can use, um, different materials that you use for technical theater. If a dancer loves to dance, they, would, they love to create and express themselves. This gives them a chance to express themselves. Using our unique ideas to like show who we really are and also us being different, she likes to really value that. In the 21 years that I've been here, we have been to other states. We have been out of the country because I always want the kids to be learning not only in the classroom, but get a chance to be in the professional setting. So when we go outside and we travel to other places, I can easily apply these skills that Miss Water has teaching me here. So welcome to our Engineering Academy and Pathway. This is one of our strongest magnetic attractions here at Southeast. We have students coming from every corner and every pocket of Wake County to participate in this exponential form of teaching and learning in the engineering areas. It encompasses so many different facets of engineering, including biomedical science, IT, cybersecurity, civil engineering, aerospace, and when you meet Mr. Barnes in our aerospace classroom, he's the only teacher, by the way, that is certified to teach our students to uh, become certified as a drone pilot. Uh, we have partnered with Barrington Irving, who's a renowned international pilot, where he's teaching our students to become certified to go directly into the workforce. The biggest thing is parents can expect them to be a little bit more prepared for a future career in the engineering fields. Uh, it's a very rigorous uh, course of study. Some of the big opportunities for the academy that I really like to push uh, is a little bit smaller learning environment. Uh, so kids get more one-on-one -on -one time with the teacher. You also get the academy coordinator. So she kind of functions as like an extra guidance counselor really looking out for you individually. We are the only, only school in Wake County who offers the Project Lead the Way curriculum, which is project-based learning, you know, hands-on, rigorous curriculum. As you can see behind me, this is my senior level class. Um, our entire biomedical academy runs the Project Lead the Way biomedical curriculum. This is the senior capstone course where the students are going to learn how to conduct independent research. And at the end of five weeks, they will present to uh, industry executives. So the kids, when we go on field trips and we have speakers come in, they're seeing how much of a biomedical science and health science presence there really is in the triangle. And our school is well supported from all of these industries. It's taught me so much about all the different careers that we have. And it's shown me that there's so much more than I, than I thought. You get to do a lot of cool things. Uh, one of my favorite things to do is probably do uh, field trips especially uh, the ones where we get to go to the laboratories. We look at different programming languages. Once you learn the concepts, it's easier to apply it to different languages. The concepts are always going to be the same. Python 1 and Python 2 is more in-depth, where you learn how to do the actual programming. I feel like it's going to really help me with how I plan to be a programmer in the future. I've heard kids say things like, um, math is not for me, and this looks like a foreign language. Once they understand it, they go, oh, this isn't so hard. I teach the cybersecurity class here, network engineering, aerospace engineering, as well as the drone fundamentals class, drone technology one and drone technology two classes here. We have equipment that you won't get at any other school. We have programs you can't get at any other school. Uh, and we have a culture here that I think you can't get at any other school. All my teachers are 
like accepting to me and like uh, how I do things on and I follow how they do things. Always safety comes first. Remember that. At the present moment, uh, Southeast Raleigh Magna High School is the only school that offers our students the ability to receive their Part 107 commercial drone license which allows them to do commercial work. So far it's been really fun learning about how they actually work and getting to learn about all the regulations and stuff to hopefully eventually get my license to fly commercially. So I'm really elated that you've had the opportunity to explore our performing arts department, our engineering, and now we're on to fine arts with digital, visual, broadcasting as part of our fine arts too, as well as humanities. And so we'll get a moment to talk to these highly qualified and certified teachers who are equally passionate about the fine arts. Their students are doing absolutely amazing things in these classes. The work that they're producing is comparable to works that you would see in the museum. AP Art gives students who are um, excelling at art the chance to choose their own projects as well as earn college credits. The main skill developments other than specific art making tasks would be learning to use what you have and figure out how to make it work, their ability to think differently than other people and have an issue with something and then be able to solve their own problem. We do a lot of work that kind of works on basic life skills. I've had students tell me that this transfers to careers they want to do where they are working with tools. The proud principal here at Southeast Raleigh Magna High School and one thing that just stands out is that we are family here. A lot of times you go to uh, various things and it's just one dimensional but we have the family component that goes along with our extraordinary program. It's a widespread of number one great teachers great experience. This is my favorite school. Um, I love it. High school is amazing.